Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. It is your boy Sizzy. Today I'm going to be showcasing one of the most overpowered scripts for the Roblox game at Lumber Tycoon 2, which has got dupe, vehicle mods, teleports, and a lot more options. But before we get into today's video, make sure to drop a like, comment, and subscribe, and let's get straight into the video. So first of all, what you guys want to do is head on over to the link in the description, which will bring you to my website, sizzyscripts.com and you want to come to the scripts page and you want to find Lumber Tycoon, it should be at the top of the scripts page or you can search for it if you want. Now once you guys do that, you want to come into uh, Blue Stacks or whatever emulator you're using and I have showcased a video on how to still exploit, you know, past the UWP patch. So once you guys have executed your, ex uh, uh, your script, I was about to say executor, once you guys execute the script, this will automatically pop up because there is no key system. So here we can uh, see the credits and the settings. So toggle UI, I've just changed it to L because right shift wasn't working. Um, you can reset your config, uh, dev logs are on and you can do rejoin if you want. So that is everything for the home tab. For the player, we've got walk speed, jump power, sprint speed and so on. So we go ahead here and turn this up a little bit and as you can see we walk faster which is pretty nice um, so it works the same for uh, jump par as well so if we go ahead and do that so that's the basic stuff um, if you want to enable sprint you can enable sprint if you want to enable flight and that's the keybind. If you want to do a keybind for infinite jump and no clip, you can also click and do that. You've got anti AFK, which is on. And then you've got light as well. And you've got safe death. So if you have any axes or whatever, if you click safe death, then you'll not lose any. Teleports, you can teleport to the waypoints. So as you can see, I'm here right now. Um, if you want to teleport to a player, you can. Um, and you can teleport to a player's base. Nah, I don't have one down and don't know why it doesn't let us teleport there. I think it needs refreshed, but um, as you can see, the teleports to different places actually work. So it is pretty nice after all. Um, so you can go anywhere in the map pretty much. Um, so yeah, that is nice. Um, if we come to tools, you've got custom dragger, which just makes everything easier to drag. And then you've got B tools, which you don't really need. World, you can do day, night, no fog. If you want shadows enabled or disabled, if you want better water, if you want to walk on the water, and if you want to remove the water, uh, just depend on what way you're going to play. If you need to go on the water, you're better off deleting it or you can walk on it. But uh, each to their own and then timers it tells you when the ferry departure is if the furniture store is opened on the car store then slot you can fast load a slot so you need to choose which number uh, mine's one obviously um, but uh, I don't even think I've got a base in this uh, account so we're not going to do that um, you can do free land max land so if we do free land, there we go, we got free land, max land, we've done that. And then if you see in the top right here, our money, we can sell the sign and we got 500. And then you can, you know, save it different slot names if you want. So that is basically the slot options dupe. Um, you can choose how many dupes, choose your slot number, your wait time, you can dupe your inventory, count your axes, drop your axes, uh, sold sign dupe, uh, you can do that if you want as well. Vehicle, you can choose your vehicle speed if you want to flip it, if you want to choose a car color and you can start it. Um, obviously it does take money to do this so it's not free. Um, sorter, you've got your X, Y and Z your speed, your player, and your stop. Um, so basically you gotta find out the X, Y, and Z of your base and it will put everything there. Uh, I don't really use this, so I'm not gonna be doing anything with it. Um, auto buy, you can select your amount, which is, I just do one. You can do open box, select your item, purchase them, purchase all blueprints, and you can abort purchasing. 
and then you can buy the toll bridge the ferry ticket on power of ease if you want but we're gonna go ahead here and buy uh a nice little axe here so as you can see uh our axe is actually bought um so yeah it should let me um open up i don't know um then woods you can select an item like which tree you want to do and you can bring that tree choose the amount you can mod the wood and uh, you can sell them as well using this but as you can see i don't have any axes or conveyors so you can go through and do that yourself trolling you've got clear all shop items choose a player here um, you can bring the player, kill the player, and on the blacklist the player. So that is everything in today's video. If you guys did enjoy, then make sure you drop a like, comment, and subscribe. And if you're still having a hard time trying to figure out how to bypass Roblox, then watch some of my videos. I've made two so far on two different emulators. And depending on your PC, one of them will work better. Now, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.